Hello everybody, welcome to a new series. Um, first of all, I'd just like to quickly thank for 275 subscribers, but there will be another video for that with a giveaway of some sort. Anyway, so today is a new series of Unity tutorials, which will happen over the next few weeks. Um, I'm going to do three different ones. I'm going to do beginner, um, advanced, uh, in uh, intermediate and advanced, or whatever, I can't say it. Um, so you'll get the basic stuff, and then more coding side stuff, and then we'll get on to like really advanced stuff, uh, which is, yeah. So, um, yeah, excuse the Bandicam thing that's on the top of the screen, because I know it's there. Um, I, none of the screen recorders are working apart from this, and the crack won't work that I can try and get hold of. Yes, I use cracks for things, I don't always have to pay for things if you can get them for free. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so just, I will try and fix that for uh, another episode, but just try and ignore that as much as you can. Um, okay, so this episode is going to be pretty short, just basically, uh, you're going to get your project set up for the tutorials. So this is going to be the beginner one, I may record the other ones at the same time, but if you want the advanced ones, then just wait until they're out. Um, but do let me know what you want in the videos, um, you can put that in now while I sort of show you how to do it, when, because you'll, there'll be a process where it's downloading so you can see what type of game you might want to create or something, so yeah. Oh, no, that wrong thing, and um, that's Unity, but first of all you're going to want to go to the Unity website, that's unity3d.com, or I think it might be another address for anything, you can change your language if you're a different language and you're watching this with rubbish captions on YouTube. Um, you can hit the download button, and you hit the download Unity 4.1.5, uh, I think I'm using 4.1.4 or 4.1.2. Uh, let me just double check which one I'm using. Ah, oh, 4.1.4. That's only because um, I really can't be bothered to update. <laughs> um, you can get all oh, right built-in shaders. I think it's up for Pro. Ooh, I might have to look at that for another tutorial. Uh, I suppose you might be able to just download them. I don't know. Hmm, I don't know. Um, so basically, there'll be a process. You basically choose where to download it to. You do all that, and then you Unity will open. It won't look like this. Oh my god. Um, for you, it won't look like this straight away. Uh, what you'll have to do, if it if it doesn't if it doesn't actually have anything here, then just go uh, file new project, and then um, I'm gonna create a new project. Now I'm gonna quickly put it into a different folder. I put it in D, and then oh my god, there's so much here. I right, click. Da, 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 da. New folder, and then you can call it whatever you want. So basically, it's the name of your game or project or something. So I just could call it Unity 3D Project. That's now the folder for the game, and then that's now it's selected. And then import the following packages. Character controller, light cookies, light flares, particles, physical materials, projector, projectors, script, skyboxes, st uh, in standard assets mobile because they've now imported mobile, so we can turn it into mobile later on. That will be in the more advanced stuff though. Terrain assets, Tesla and shaders, tune shading, tree creator, and water basic. And then click create. Then that will do, and then it will do. Uh, I'm not sure if you can see it or not, but it'll have this logo and it'll have bars. Now, while basically any time between the download process and this process, in the comments below, let me know what you want it to be in these tutorials. Um, because most things are pretty easy, but don't go ahead and straight away say multiplayer because that will not be done until the more advanced stuff. If you want multiplayer or something, go and find another tutorial because it's not going to be done straight away on this channel. I want to get you guys learning from the start. We're going to make a game from scratch. We're not going to jump in at deep end and stuff. If you want to uh, do certain things, let me know. I might be able to help you. Um, their tutorials will try and be out daily. So multiplayer could be here within the next three weeks. So just sit tight and go through these tutorials because I want to sort of get you guys. I won't have people learning Unity properly. But anyway, um, this is just kind of the short episodes, the introduction episode. So um, I will see you in the next episode where we're going to start the game. But I'm going to need your suggestions for the next episode. So let me know what 
game we're going to create and uh, the next tutorial will be out tomorrow when I know what we're making. Goodbye.